Now, here's your Pinpoint Weather 12 forecast. Well, we've got a quiet night across our area. Clouds are in place and looking at some rain and snow showers possible after midnight and towards daybreak tomorrow and pretty much throughout the day on Friday. So let's take a look outside. This is Providence again. Gray skies as has been the case all week long. And that'll continue for one more day for Friday and then we'll finally see some brighter skies for the weekend. But here's that wide view of the radar. You can see some rain and snow showers across parts of uh, Pennsylvania, New York, New Jersey, Connecticut, and we'll see some of those kind of skim the area later on tonight, especially for for coastal regions in the form of some rain showers and sprinkles after midnight. Better chance of seeing some of those flakes mixing in further north where it's going to be a little bit colder. Temperatures right now upper 30s in Smithfield, 40 in Providence, 41 in Westerly, 40 down in Newport. So three key things again rain snow showers very isolated after midnight and then through Friday as well really just a cloudy time uh, cloudy skies for Friday bright and dry though for the weekend sunshine returns temperatures near 40 and really no major storms in our seven day forecast so some good news there here's that wide view though you can see some of the rain and snow shower activity off to the west of us cold front gonna be making its way through overnight and into tomorrow and that's gonna be what's, what's triggering off these rain and snow showers uh, at times throughout uh, the final day of the work week so let's talk things out overnight tonight clouds in place temperatures going to be falling through the 30s and we'll bottom out in the low to mid 30s overnight notice this, some of these rain showers here kind of hugging the coastline across parts of southeastern connecticut and uh, western rhode island as well these are going to be tracking through overnight and towards daybreak tomorrow again not really a big deal here at 6 a.m tomorrow morning lots of clouds in place chilly temperatures but notice not much in the way of precip so if there is anything you know like a rain shower or a snow shower nearby it's gonna be very isolated and not gonna be covering the entire area notice about 9 a.m a few of these still making their way through from time to time similar story for the afternoon temperatures will be in the upper 30s to near 40 though so it'll be a little bit milder so it'll be more of the rain shower variety passing on through here's 4 p.m notice temperatures dipping back into the 30s here and watch what happens as you go into uh, the seven, eight, nine o'clock at night time frame. Some snow showers tracking on through. Temperatures in northwestern parts of Rhode Island are going to be in the uh, lower 30s here. So I have to watch that closely. You may get a quick dusting in Burrowville and Pasco tomorrow night as some of these snow showers track on through. And again, not going to be a big deal either way, but still uh, noteworth noteworthy for tomorrow night's forecast. Otherwise, looking at drying conditions as we go into Friday night and into Saturday. So Friday morning's forecast, clouds, sprinkle and flurries, only about a 20% chance through the daytime hours. Temperatures getting to about 40 degrees for the afternoon. Here's that seven day forecast for you. Again, the big story, the sunshine making a return just in time for the weekend, upper 30s to near 40 for both days. Cool conditions for the weekend into next week. Temperatures drop back in the middle 30s for Tuesday and Wednesday, watching some flurries and snow showers and windy conditions too uh, for the middle part of next week. But as of right now, no major storm systems in that seven day forecast. So guys, we'll send things back to you.